appreciate you taking the time. Uh, let, let's start off, uh, you're running, running into micro, and tell us a little bit about uh, what division you're in and what you have planned for 2016. It's a 270 micro sprint. We run on quarter mile, three eight mile dirt tracks. And uh, it's powered by, most of them are powered by a Honda, like a 250 engine that would come off a Honda CR250 motorcycle, or two stroke. And uh, in this area, there's multiple tracks we can pick from. I, we choose to run different tracks all over the place, but only because I've been doing this forever. I'm one of the older, older guys in this, and uh, we run Path Valley, Trailway, then the Speedway, and then we travel around. If it's a big money show, uh, we'll travel New York, we'll travel, travel Western PA, and it's just a lot, it's a great bunch of drivers and a great division to be involved with. Brian, and, and I'm glad you brought that up. You said you're a veteran of the ranks. That's one of the cool things that I've seen about the micros. You see guys that uh, are probably still well into their school career, and then, then guys uh, like you and I who are well into their adult working career that uh, do this on the side and have a great time at it. Very competitive division. Yeah, that's what makes it fun. I mean, uh, like myself, I've been in it. Well, I've been in some sort of racing for 30 straight years. Started out racing motocross, and for the last 16 years, I've been running micros. And uh, I ran 358 sprints for a couple seasons. And uh, this 270 division, we got a lot of young guys, a lot of young kids, like two sitting beside me. And um, I tell you what, I know I race a lot with Corey. Just because they're young, don't mean they're lacking experience. These kids have been racing since they've been really little. And uh, I'd rather race with a lot of them than some of the older guys that don't have no experience. Right, I imagine uh, the younger guys, uh, sometimes they turn up the heat on you and you gotta, you gotta stay, in, stay in shape, right? Oh, most definitely. I mean, um, when you're in that car, you're not thinking about age or, or, or the driver. All you know is uh, you're, you're pushing to the end. And it don't matter what number comes up on the board, you can't take any, anything for granted out there. And, uh, I found that out with Corey and several other guys I raced with, his brothers. And like Corey, he grew up in a racing family, so he, he's been around it. All right, Brian, before we move on, uh, I forgot to ask, tell us where you're from and uh, any, any sponsors or any crew members you need to thank uh, for the 2016 season. Well, I'm from Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, and uh, my longtime sponsor has been Interstate Batteries, Fast Signs, and then uh, I got some. Other, a lot of other sponsors that make it happen, and uh, in the last year or so, I have, I have some great friends who really stepped up to help me out, and uh, that's made the difference. We had off season last year, uh, we're used to winning, and uh, last year we didn't get any wins. We were in position to win a lot, but something happened, and uh, this year, as you'll see, we have new cars sitting back there, so I don't want to just get back to where we were. I want to make it even a better year than we ever had this year. All right, Brian Marriott, looking forward to 2016.